Hi, I'm Nicole O'Connor at Afterlife Antiques and Oddities in Madison, Wisconsin, and this is our two-headed calf. He was born in 1934 in Belgium, Wisconsin, and he was born on a farm and he lived for five minutes. After that, his owners decided to get him taxidermied and now he's living with us. These are more common to see as gaffs or fakes, so you'd be able to see a seam running down between the two faces, but this one's pretty smooth, so that's how you can tell if it is an authentic kind of deformed creature or not. But I think it's kind of unusual to get them taxidermied, especially in the 30s when people wouldn't have had a lot of money to throw around, so that's kind of why it leads me to believe that it was um, kind of an amateur taxidermy taxidermy job, although they did a pretty good job of it, but it might have been a hobby for somebody. Did you give it a name? I didn't. A lot of people ask me that, but I haven't been able to think of one yet. I'm open for suggestions, though. If you want to submit ideas, we're on Facebook, and we're also at afterlife.antiques at icloud.com.